Oh shit! It's your boy, Mr. ILTBA. I'm touching down from that two, one, four, and I'm on that bullshit again. And I'm on that bullshit today, right? Y'all know how I do ILTBA. Y'all know how I do. I was scrolling up my articles, and what do I see? I see O'Hara. Davis from across the pond. I think some fighter named Josh Taylor made him quit. And that's what you get. So y'all know how I do. Y'all know how I do ILTBA. I must address the bullshit. O'Hara Davis. That's what the fuck you get. Josh Taylor, understand this, sir. He beat your ass into submission. Let me tell y'all why I got a problem with this O'Hara Davies. This was the same cocky son of a bitch, right, who came up to Floyd because he was mad Floyd compared him to Javante Davis. He said, Floyd, I feel like that's disrespectful, you comparing me to Javante Davis. I'm the best 140 pounder in the world. He's 130 pounds. I think that's disrespectful. Floyd looked at that motherfucker like, and, what, and how old are you? He said 25, and what's your record? 15 and 0. He said, motherfucker, Tank Davis, 17 and 0 with 16 knockouts, and he the youngest. Champion in boxing. That's first off. Who the fuck do this dude thought he was? Come running up on Floyd. Talking about he feel disrespected. Because he compared him to Tank Davis. Are you fucking kidding me? You cocky son of a... That's what the fuck you get. Now let's go on to this other one. I, I, I was scrolling up my articles. Then I see this motherfucker was talking about Terrence Crawford. How this motherfucker say, ain't nobody beating Terrence Crawford. And he said, including myself. Then he tried to clean that shit up, say, oh, if, if I have to face Terrence Crawford, whenever that time would come, you know, I'd be more experienced than I am right now. I'd go on the training camp and I'd be able to beat, I feel like I could beat anybody. Motherfucker, you lost me when you said Terrence Crawford, can't nobody beat him, including yourself. Now, when I seen that interview the other fucking day, when you did that, I say, this dude right here is done. Whoever the fuck is, because I didn't know who the fuck dude was. I ain't going to sit up here in front. I said, who? I had to look. I said, whoever this dude is, he done. With that type of fucking that you talking about, uh, ain't, ain't nobody beating him, including myself, motherfucker. That's why you quit this previous fight. I was like, hold up. This motherfucker say, ain't nobody better. Than, ain't nobody beating him, including myself. Then he trying to clean, no, nah, motherfucker. You lost me when you said that. I knew you was the, and that's what the fuck you Get. Now, I was scrolling up my articles just a few minutes ago. I see an interview with this my immediate reaction with this O'Hara Davis dude after his fight with IFL TV, wherever they from. I know they're across the pond, I'm just not sure where they from. So the reporter, the reporter say, um, I know this is a tough loss for you. And he say, what you mean tough loss? I mean, he said, I know this feel, he said, he know he feeling some type of way. It's tough for him right now. He say, what you mean? Oh, cocky son of a bitch, gonna, talk about, gonna look at the reporter talking about what you mean tough for me. He say, no, it's tough for you because you got to go interview everybody like this. I'm looking at this Cocky son of a bitch after he just quit saying that to that report. I'm like, motherfucker, then he gonna have the nerve to say, talking about, because I made six figures. It wasn't tough for me. I'm going to do this. Who the fuck do you think you are? Then he said,
say, oh, um, I got my, I got my girlfriend, I got my, my, my real friends who I hang around every day. The, the only meals, the people who thought I was a hype train, the, they're the ones who probably not gonna like me. But this cocky son of a bitch, after he just quit. He quit in that fight. This motherfucker told him, I'ma still talk shit. I'ma still be who I be because boxing is me. You cocky son of a bitch. You see how that, that's, listen, dude. Dude, with that attitude right there, dude, that's the fucking reason why you got humbled against Josh Taylor. I think that's his. That's the reason why you got humbled, sir. And dude, I ain't gonna believe in you in another fight with that attitude and then we just seen you quit? Who the fuck do you think you are? But that's what happened with cocky motherfuckers like you who tried to run up on Floyd to mad because he compared you to Javante Davis. Motherfucker, you just quit. We ain't never seen... Man, stop playing with me. Y'all know how I do. Y'all know how I do. Mr. 2-1. I'm on that bullshit again.